Hello, welcome to jasonnewland.com. My name is Jason Newland and this is Let Me Bore You to Sleep. It's the second introduction I've done so far for this recording because I just pressed a button which cancelled what I was doing, which was a slightly, slightly, incredibly, really annoying. <laughs> no, that's all right. I was only about a minute in, so it doesn't matter. Uh, so what is it? Yeah, this is Let Me Boy You Sleep. Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes. Um, check out my website, jasonnewland.com, because every recording I've done is on there. Uh, it's it's uh, 1,150 plus recordings. You can also find out a little bit more about me. Um, there's a testimonial page where you can read what other people have said, maybe leave your own testimonial. There's a gift me page where you can uh, send me a gift if you choose. There is a podcast page which lists all the different podcasts that I've got. And, you know, there's lots of stuff. The website's never really going to be completed because there's always something new that can be done. There's always something extra that can be added and... Yeah, so it's, it's kind of never finished. But uh, my plan is to keep this website as it is and just add to it and not change it again and use another host provider and all that stuff that I've done continuously um, since 2000, and, well, since 2004, actually. Well, actually, since 2000 when I first started making websites. So yeah, can't believe it, nearly 20 years since I've been uh, making websites. My very first website, if I remember, my, my first actual website, you know, the uh, domain name was called Tidy Search. It's either .com or .co.uk. I'm sure it was tidysearch.com. Might have been called .co.uk. And uh, in those days, there wasn't lots of different domain names, uh, extensions like there are now. Like .co.uk, .pizza, delivery, you know, things like that. Cause now, it's loads. Uh, .net came along. Um, I think it was kind of, what was it, .com, then .co.uk, and then .net, kind of started to take the place of the .com, because they were running out of .coms, and that's just in England, I mean, uh, .net was an international one, like .com, .co.uk, of course, was for the UK, um, and then you've got .nz for New Zealand, .com, but also .com that New Zealand, you know. So people from all over the world, businesses had .com domains. Some couldn't get a .com because it was already taken. So if you, I heard something. I don't know if it's true, but I think someone owned Amazon.co.uk that domain name. And Amazon, and they held on to it. I mean, that they might have just been, they might have just been making a website about pictures of the Amazon forest, or it might be in a, you know, to save the Amazon forest, it might be some kind of charity or something. I don't know, but anyway, they had the .co.uk, Amazon.co.uk, and Amazon wanted it and again I don't know if this is true or not I might have just made it up on the spot it's possible I do that a lot 
but I'm pretty sure that they paid a huge amount of money to purchase the dot, you know, the Amazon.co.uk domain name. So yeah, it's uh, there's definitely money to be made for those that know what they're doing, but that's that's a case for everything, though, isn't it? Really, apart from what I do, there's no <laughs> there's no money. But if people are really good at something, generally, or if they know if they know a subject really well, uh, whether it's trading or banking or uh, medical or I don't know the law or whatever, they I'm trying to think of different things. There's so many different subjects, but if you if you really really know your stuff, then it's there's value to that, isn't there? So someone that they knew, they kind of perhaps knew, and they looked at this little company called Amazon back in the early days that wasn't going to actually make a profit for another. 18 years or something but they thought oh we keep hold of this yeah I wonder if someone's got an alibaba.co.uk they just had it because they, they liked the name or maybe wasn't it a wasn't it a what's it and all part of the old flying carpet books and uh, secret uh, open sesame and stuff like that you know Sinbad and stuff like that so I just uh, because Alibaba is one of the biggest websites in the world but it's in where is it in? Is it India? Or is it China? Anyway, it's one of the countries that has the most amount of people, which is India or China or Russia, isn't it? And then America, I think. How cool would that be if I just named, in order, the top populated countries? I know China is... Because not many countries have over a billion people. China does, India does. Um, Isle of Wight, I'm not sure. I don't think the Isle of Wight does. Um, Norwich, I don't think Norwich. What other countries has over a billion billion, that's quite a lot, isn't it, quite a lot of people, a billion, ah, I'm not sure, I know America's got about 360 million, and Canada, although it's a much bigger country than America, space, like land-wise, isn't it, it's, uh, I think they've got about the same population as what we've got here, about 60 million, I think. But then I saw this documentary on YouTube and it was about, I don't know if it was Nicaragua or was it, was it, Was it? No, not Liverpool. It was. Where was it? It was. Um, like South America, I think. But I might be wrong again. It might be Africa. Doesn't Africa have over a billion? So India, Africa, and China, and Russia. Those are the places that have over over a billion. But then Africa is a continent, isn't it? 
although some people live in Africa don't class it as that we need to get rid of continents just stick with adjectives we need to get rid of um, get rid of continents just have one country anything that's surrounded by sea that's a country I think that should just be the law from tomorrow think of all the all the fun we'll get to watch on the telly all the news bulletins <laughs> the wall has been cancelled the wall is uh, it's just like oh well, no we're Americans we're coming in no, how, do you, how do people work out how do you work out when you're on the same land it's the same land I mean, literally, you can talk to somebody in another country. If you're sharing the same land, which is the continent you're sharing. Hi. Oh, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, thanks. Oh, well, stay there, won't you? Why? Well, you, this is our country here. You're not allowed in. We have to check your bags for food and stuff. Make sure you're not bringing in bananas. What? Yeah. But it's the same ground. Ground. It's the same land. No, not really. Yeah, it is. No. No, it's a different country. How can it be a different country? You're over there. And we're over here. How can I, I can see you. We can... We can talk to each other without a phone. We, uh, why why can that be a different country? Well, we've got different weather, haven't we? Well, weather looks the same as it does here. Yeah, but I don't mean just here. Well, where then? Well, back home where I live, it's raining. Yeah, back home where I live, it's raining. Oh, where do you live then? I live at home. Oh, me too. So it's raining where you are? Yeah, well not here, because we're both in the same place. No, we're not. We're different countries. I'm here and you're over there. Yeah, but there's 20 foot between us. 20 feet between us. How can that be a different country? Well, it's a continent, isn't it? What does that mean? I don't, I'm not sure. It just means that it's like invisible... If you think of it like invisible water, like the invisible sea. Yeah. Well, that's what it is. We're in Ireland, surrounded by invisible sea. But in reality connected to other islands. That's also surrounded by invisible sea. And the way we try and make sure you all know is we speak different languages. Well, how did that happen? How did how did you manage to speak a different language from me? Well, I don't, do I? Because otherwise you wouldn't understand me. I said, yeah, but yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, but how do you, how can we speak different languages when there's 20 foot difference between us? 20 feet, and why, why, would you, why not just all speak the same language? Well, I think there's been people in history that thought that was a good idea, and they weren't very popular. Oh, okay, fair. Well, I don't, I don't want to go down that road, but I'm just saying, how come we speak different languages? That was more what I was saying. If you, well, they were popular for a while, but you know, afterwards, not so much. Yeah, no, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about you. It's, there's twenty foot difference between us. How how can that be a divide? How 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 is that even possible? Well, I'll be honest with you. It happened a little bit before my time. What what did? Well, in 
the old days? Yeah. People used to fight over territory. Yeah. And that's it, really. So how, how, so, so basically what you're saying is that line, that invisible, it's invisible, isn't it? Well, it's invisible if you don't know it's there. What? It's invisible if you don't know it's there. I did actually understand what you said. You didn't have to say it really slowly like... I don't need to be spoon-fed words. I do understand what you're saying. I just... It's not really a line, is it? So, so what you're telling me, okay, what you're telling me is that that... Because we're in a field, yeah? We're in a field at the moment. So those... Uh potatoes that are over there on your side of the line the invisible line that no one can see but we all know it's there and the potatoes my line um, on my side of the line they're completely different potatoes well yeah everything's unique isn't it no I don't mean different in that way what I mean is oh this is difficult uh The pota- they're potatoes, aren't they? Yeah. You are clever. Oi. Oh, sorry. Listen, they're potato. They're- what difference is there? I mean, they they don't have different accents. They don't speak a different language. They don't taste any different. They're the same potatoes from the same family, made from the same feed. You know, the same seeds and grown by the same soil. Yeah. So, what's the difference? The invisible line. Okay. So, basically what you're saying is... We all share the same land, the same ground. It's all connected. But each of our little bits of ground, or big bits, whatever is surrounded by an invisible line which no one can see but everyone knows is there that is almost like an invisible sea that's surrounding each part of the continent which we call countries so it's like invisible islands well no sort of like islands with an invisible sea but instead of the sea there's an invisible line is that what you're saying? I'm not sure. What do you mean? Well, I got a little bit confused, if I'm honest. About what? Well, you. What about me? We just kept going on and on. I didn't... I'll be honest with you, I got a little bit bored. When you were talking, I kind of drifted off a bit. You drifted off a bit? Yeah. I started thinking about what I was going to have for dinner. What? It's it's a bit rude, isn't it? Well, we've all got to eat, haven't we? Got to have something to eat. Yeah, but why were you thinking about dinner while I was talking? I don't know, I was just so bored. It was just, it was almost like my brain switched off. And I just, just, I couldn't, I just didn't want to listen anymore. Okay, don't hold back, will you? You know. What do you mean? I said, don't hold back, just say what you think. Well, yeah, I just did say what I think. I know, but it's, it's sarcasm. Don't, don't... What do you mean? 
uh, uh, sarcasm. You know sarcasm? No, we don't have that here. The invisible line stops it getting past. Stops it getting through. We don't need a wall. <laughs> We've just got the invisible line. Okay. What do you keep talking about a wall for? Well, you were talking about a wall earlier. Yeah, but not with a conversation with you. That was that was a precursor to this conversation. You weren't even invented at that point. What do you mean invented? You weren't you weren't a part of the of the you weren't part of the podcast. You weren't part of the of the audio recording. Are you recording this? Yeah. Yeah, I am recording this. Why? Well, I do these, basically I do these recordings to uh, help people to sleep, to, um, yeah, it's it's just to help people to relax, feel calm, uh, um, maybe, you know, also sort of keeping them company, maybe. I've been told that's what benefit people get. Um, that wasn't actually my initial uh, goal. It was really just to send people, people to sleep. Uh, and then sort of it's developed over time into whatever it currently is. And it, I'm probably sure it will develop into something different or some, you know, in the future. You, are you listening? Oh, sorry, I, I drifted off. You really are very boring. <laughs> That's a bit rude, isn't it? Oh, sorry, I can't help it. I just, I just say it how it is. No. Say it how it is. That's an incorrect term. What do you mean? Well, saying it how it is presupposes that how you think is somehow the way it is for everybody. Yeah. Well, it isn't, is it? Why? Well, just because you have an opinion on what you think something, uh, you, you, how you perceive something, isn't going to be the way other people perceive it, is it? Why? Um, um, I don't know how to answer that. Why? You're just going to keep saying why? Are you trying to wind me up? No. Well, yeah. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. Anyway. Yeah. Why? <laughs> yeah, no, I'm just kidding. Well, um... What are you doing a recording for, then? I, I told you it was about... Helping people to sleep. Well, shouldn't you have asked my permission if you were going to be recording me? Perhaps in different circumstances. Such as? Well, if you... Mm. existed. What are you talking about, Willis? I said, my name isn't Willis. My name is not Willis. I oh, know, but it's from different strokes, remember? Yeah, of course I do. What are you talking about, Willis? You know what? For years, I used to think, I forgot, you know, because I hadn't seen it for a long time. I used to think it was, what are you talking about, Will? But it's not, it's Willis. What are you talking about, Willis? That's really, really nice that you keep repeating that. 
well, you know, it works much better with the face. If you could put, like, make that, like, grumpy face and just, what are you talking about? Whoosh, and just stare at the person. Really works. Okay, let me ask you a question. What? In what particular scenario could that work? Well, before I answer that, let me ask you a question. Yeah, go on then. Do you by any chance watch Curb Your Enthusiasm with Larry David? Yeah, I have. So you just copied him, didn't you? What? When you said, uh, can I ask you a question? That's what he says. Yeah, yeah, but he's not the only person that's allowed to, to say a sentence. I mean, I suppose. But the way you presented it, it was a little bit Larry David-esque, if you know what I mean. I don't really think it was. Yeah, mm, it was. No, I don't think it was. Mm, no, I think you're wrong. I think it was. Yeah, but you got a lot of thinking, haven't you? You got a lot of opinions for yourself. What, what, what about having an open mind? What do you mean? Well, it's in. I hope you don't mind me saying so. Uh, with respect, you seem quite small-minded and quite closed off to you know things. Did you just say with respect before you said that? Yeah, you, you heard I just said that. Well, what part of it was respectful? And also, what's that noise in the background? That's, that's Andre. He don't off. I think he's getting heavier because I've been feeding him twice a day. And because uh, it's the cold weather, it's really got cold lately, and he's sleeping more, but also I think giving him a bit more food just so he can just help him keep warm, I suppose. I'm not sure if that makes sense. Um, well, okay, I'll, I'll reverse it. In the summer, he is less hungry. Yeah. He seems to be hungrier at the moment than normal. Yeah. Why are you saying, yeah, like there's something else to come? I just told you what I was saying. Yeah. No, that's it. Can you please stop it? No. Why are you so annoying? I'm not. What do you mean you're not? Well, how can I be? What? That's a weird question. How can you be? Well, what does that mean? Well, you said that you created me. That I'm not even real. Yeah. Well, therefore... Yeah. Whatever I say... Also isn't real. Yeah, I know, but... For the sake of the tape... Can you just, like, forget that bit? No... Sorry. With respect. Nah. 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 That was a weird sound. Not as weird as you. What, what 
does that even mean? You start saying stuff that doesn't even mean anything. Like, what do you mean, not even mean? I don't sound like that. Yeah, you do to me. Yeah, well, maybe to you. Not to me. Yeah, I've noticed your voice is changing a little bit. Yeah, I know. Why is that? Well, I kind of forgot what my voice was at the beginning of the uh, recording. And now it seems to have changed a little bit. Yeah. Well, it's not totally easy to do two different voices at the same time. Well, you know, in a conversation. Okay. And also, you know, as you're in the, in the judging zone, I've noticed that your voice has been getting deeper. What do you mean? <coughs> Was that a sarcastic laugh? No. I genuinely found it funny. <coughs> That's not a real laugh. It might be. No, it's not. How do you know? It doesn't matter how I know. The point is it ain't. Perhaps it is. Perhaps it isn't. Are you making fun of the way I talk? No. Are you making fun of the way I talk? That wasn't even a sentence. It wasn't even a pinch. What are you doing? Pinch it with booby. Stop it. Stop it. Now that was good. At least that was a good, a proper word. <laughs> what was that? Well, no offence, but uh, when you talk, all I hear is. What? Yeah, it's true. It's, it's all I hear. And the beginning of that, you said no offence. Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, now that was a genuine laugh. That's different to the other one you had. No, you don't try and put on a, a weird laugh again like it's real. That one you just did then was real, but that, that fake one that sounded like a a gremlin in a blender, that now that that wasn't real. That's well, a bit of a horrible visual, isn't it? What? A gremlin in a blender. Yeah, okay, let's move on. I should move on when I see fit to move on. Besides, I want to hear more about these recordings. <sighs> okay, um... Well, I told you, really, I make the recordings to help people to go to sleep. So, yeah, what, what do you do? Well, I don't really do anything. I just... Um, I just talk for about an hour. Yeah. That's it. You talk for about an hour. Yeah. But, um... Well... Can you say more? Not really. That's, that's about it. Is this what you're like in a job interview? What? Well, I just imagine you being in a job interview and the 
person interviewing you saying, oh, so can you tell me more about your your last job? Or, and you just said, just saying, no, I just turned up. You'd never get a job. Well, I'll have you know that I've, I have had jobs. I worked for 25, 26 years and I was always able to get work. So I must have done something right in it. Ah, you're not working now though, are you? Yeah, well, that's, that's a different, that's a different situation. That's very rude. I can't, I can't, can't believe some of the stuff you're saying. Yeah, but it's not really me, is it? Oh, you mean the having a bad day? It's not really how you normally are. No, I mean, it's not really me. What? Well, you're the one doing the talking. What are you talking about? Well, you're doing both voices. So, you're responsible for what I say. So, why on earth would you pretend to be shocked at what I've just said, what you've heard me say, when you're the one that made me say it? Because you are me. Yeah. Oh, this... It, oh, it's, it's it's complicated, isn't it? Well, does it have to be? I don't know how how would you how would you simplify it? Well, perhaps you just just have one voice and you just talk. Uh, it might be a bit easier. Yeah, <laughs> you're probably right. I mean, this just happens sometimes in the recordings. I don't, I don't plan it. Well, clearly. What, what do you mean by that? Well, if you planned it, it'd be. I don't know. It makes sense a little bit, wouldn't it? You're so rude. No, I think you find it. You're rude. You're making me rude. Blimey. This is getting... This is like hard work. Well, not really, is it? What do you... What do you, you just... Question every single thing I say. Did you just say... That I'm questioning every... every single thing you say or every single thing you say oh you know you're going to make the, make fun of the way I talk no I'm just just, I'm just asking <laughs> oh that's, that's the real laugh again yeah well you do both laugh so you're responsible I'm I'm mm, I don't know. I, I, I'm not sure. What? What is it you're not sure of? Well, I'm not sure how to end this conversation. No, I, I could. I do understand. I mean, I've been part of this conversation for the last. 15 minutes or whatever and it doesn't seem to be headed anywhere yeah I know it's a bit like your life oh he that is extra rude you can't say stuff like that yeah well, it's kind of true isn't it no I, my, my life is heading uh <laughs> It's heading somewhere. Where then? Well, I'm helping, well, I'm trying to help people through my 
internet, you know, the, the recordings I make. I'm trying, I'm trying to help people. Yeah. Well, that's it, really. Well, how is that? How is that making your life head somewhere? I'm not sure what the answer to that is. Um, well, let, let me let me ask you a different way. Okay. This is getting a little bit deep, but go on. Well, what is the benefit to you doing all these recordings? Um, uh, I feel that I'm contributing to the world, contributing, I'm making a, a contribution in my life, I'm doing something worthwhile, I think. Yeah, go on. Well, <laughs> um, oh, you put me on a spot here a bit. Oh no, it's good, isn't it? Uh, maybe, maybe not. Um, I. Um, well, that's it. It's doing something that feels worthwhile, and that is that's priceless. You know, there's no that that's the reward, I suppose. Oh, okay. So you're pretty much a saint. Is that what you're saying? No, I'm not saying that. Is it... You're perfect. No. No, of course not. And if you listen to any of my recordings, you'll know that at no point do I try and pretend that I'm perfect or that I know everything. I never pretend that I'm... Uh, I'm, I'm quite honest with people and about who I am and I think I don't know yeah I mean yeah. Well, that was a bit rude wasn't it what were you all in not really I mean this this recording is about sending people to sleep so yawning is that's a good indicator that it's working I mean if I if I tie if I if I, if I tire myself out whilst talking then there's a good chance that the person the other side of the headphones <laughs> headphones you know whoever's listening I mean will also be feeling tired as well and that was a long sentence. Well, I just answered your question. If you ask me a question, I'm going to answer. Let me ask you a question. Yeah, go on, Larry David. <laughs> let me ask you. Let me ask you a question. <laughs> I forgot which voice I was then. Let me ask... <laughs> laughing at your own jokes now are you yeah I know it's terrible isn't it let me ask you a question and I wish I could remember what the question was now I will in a minute um um let me think do you 
think that uh, your sentences may be a bit long. What do you mean? I mean, just generally. Well, if you ask me a question... Which I did. Yeah. Then my answer is whatever it is, isn't it? I mean, if you... I mean, you could just sort of say, I've got a question, can you please answer in less than seven words? But that's a little bit... It's a little bit restrictive, isn't it? I don't play those games. Don't What was that? Well, I went to start talking and my voice <laughs> went weird. So I kind of just made a funny noise instead. Oh, that's, that's a unusual thing to say. Yeah, maybe. Maybe, baby. Is that why you do the recordings? Why? Because you can't get anyone that you know to listen to you talking. So you have to put it on the internet. No. Because what I think is... Yeah, go on. What what I think... Don't worry, I was going to continue. I didn't need you to... uh, Didn't need your affirmation there. What I think is... That you... Made... A podcast... And you called it Jason's Brilliant Thoughts or Jason's Really Interesting Podcast, Jason's Really Interesting Life, Jason's Really Interesting Sentences That Last Forever. Well, no, that's none of the names, but yeah, go on. I think I'm kind of coming around. I think I know what you're going to say. Trust me, mate, you never know what I'm going to say. Well, actually, you always do, don't you? But forget that. Okay, and go on. Well, and you and you were getting downloads and it became fairly popular. And you didn't understand why, but you thought it was because you were really interesting. And then people started to send you... Well, you asked people, you said, I really like the fact that you're listening, but I'd love to get some feedback. And people started sending you comments and feedback. But it was a little bit different to what you thought it was going to be. What do you mean? Well, you thought it was going to be people saying how very interesting you are. And uh, how stimulating your conversations are. And, you know, it's that's what you thought, isn't it? I'm not answering that. Go, go on. Well, what you actually received was comments from people saying, how you're the most boring person they've ever met, ever heard, or ever listened to. And... People were just falling asleep listening to you. And that's what they listen to you for. Uh, Is that right or wrong? Well. um, And then you change your name to let me bore you to sleep. And you pretend to this day that that was your initial intention. When the reality is, you actually wanted p- 
people to be interested in what you were talking about? No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Said it three times. That makes it true. Saying something three times doesn't make it true. Oh, I suppose. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Where, where do you come up with this stuff? Well, I think you'll find it's a, a mutual arrangement. Yeah, I suppose, yeah. Anyway, that's not how it worked at all. Okay, so how did it work? Well, actually, it was almost the opposite to that. Well, not the opposite, but... <sighs> okay, it's similar. Oh, this is interesting. Well, back in 2011, or actually even further than that, 2006, I was making update videos. Well, it just be an update, is an update on how the hypnosis service is going, Oh, I've made another video for pain relief. I've done this. I've got a new website. You know, stuff like that. And I do an update. And then I talk a little bit about my life. And this was before I, before I went to university. So I remember I'd do an update saying back in November 2007 saying, oh, I've now moved into my new new little room and I'm going to be here for the next three years whilst I'm at college. And I remember I've st I haven't got that video anymore, but it's on it's on one of the other video sites, not YouTube, but one of the others. And um, you know, I did that, and then 2011 I started doing, or maybe a bit earlier than that, I started doing videos like vlogging. Uh, vlogging? No, vlogging. V L O G G I N G. Basically, blogging, but with a V instead of a B. And just talking about my life. So I did that for a while. And, well, I mean, still do it now and then. So it's between the last, for the last eight or so years I've been doing those. And. But I don't do them very often now. But I've had quite a few people tell me that in the past they were saying, oh, I love listening to you because it just sends me to sleep. And I never responded, never responded in a kind of, I just always said, oh, thank you. But deep down, I kind of, well, I've just been talking about my life. And it's boring you to sleep. That wasn't really the intention. I mean, I wasn't. I didn't expect people to jump up and down with excitement whenever I did a video. But uh, these were videos where I was talking about how I was feeling and talking about you know stuff like real stuff. And uh, I was getting feedback from people saying that. Well, actually, when I took them off YouTube. I had people contacted me saying, oh, where's your Jason Chats gone? They used to send me to sleep. Very relaxing. I was like, oh, great. So that kind of sowed the little seed in my head that maybe... Maybe I just could use that well first of all maybe I'm much more boring than I thought and secondly maybe I could use that uh, as a skill rather, <laughs> rather than a hindrance so I could uh, use it for positivity 
uh, so I could uh, yeah, take take that. Um, you do you say her a lot, ain't you? Are you you a bit nervous or what? No. I can't remember now. You've thrown me off my uh, thrown me off my uh, thought trail. When you say I've thrown you off your thought trail, is that what you really mean, or do you mean I interrupted your monologue? No. Well, maybe. Well. Monologues are easier than dialogues, you know. For some, not probably for some people, they're not. But um, um, clearly, I don't even need other people for for dialogues. I can uh, just do that myself. But monologues, I just, I don't know. I don't know why, but I just. I'm not even, I don't even particularly like talking. I'm not like a constant chatter. I can be sometimes, but I'm quite a solitudious person. Uh, I've got no idea what that means. Yeah, I think I made it up. Someone that likes to be in solitude, solitudious. Yeah, possibly. But anyway, the um, that's when I thought I'm gonna give it a go. Why not? Why not just do? Because I've done so many different things over the years. So you know, tried out different things, different uh, audio recordings, different courses, and I thought, <clears throat> let me see if this works. Let me just talk basically do a Jason Chats but don't call it Jason Chats just call it Let Me Bore You To Sleep and not do it on video just do it on audio uh, which means I can just I, when I make videos I get distracted yeah did you notice that I'm interacting with you because this isn't a monologue this is a dialogue. Yeah, but I'm just not interested in what you've got to say, though. Well, that makes two of us. Wow. Yeah, wow indeed. You're ever so rude. Oh, I'm, so, I'm sorry. I was only. Well. I wasn't really joking. I to, yeah. Uh, and I was so that's what I did I did the let me bore you to sleep and it kind of took off and uh, yeah I get a, in fact most of the feedback I get about my podcast is about this podcast so that's quite groovy. Oh, that's nice. So yeah, I just um, and then, can you believe it? This uh, well, not this podcast, but it was um, well, it's one of these podcasts, but it was on a different. It was on my like, well, one of these episodes was reviewed by a podcast reviewer. And they were saying that I was copying other people because I found out later, after I started making these recordings, that there is, I'm not the only one doing it. And there's someone that's been doing it for, well, that's the thing, he's been doing it for a while, for some years, some years. But I was making recordings long before he was. Except I wasn't calling them Let Me Boy to Sleep. But I was making sleep recordings. So I kind of think that... Well, first of all, I don't, I don't 
didn't copy anyone because no one does no one does this no one does what I do and I don't do what they do because we're all different aren't we we all do our own thing and you could have a thousand people doing exactly the same thing as this they could all call it let me bore you to sleep and just with their name or Bobby let me let Bobby bore you to sleep let Tracy boy you to sleep. Let Stevie boy you to sleep. Yeah. I'm just trying to be part of things. Yeah, go on. Okay. Um, yeah, and then each recording would be completely different from each other. Because it would be their own... I don't know, personalities or whatever that they bring to the show. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Yeah. So, that's what I do, that's what I did, and that's what I'm continuing to do. And it's just me chatting about whatever, really. Does that, uh, does that answer your question? It very much does. I'm very pleased for your answer. No matter how long it took for you to give the answer. And you know, luckily, I was able to knit myself a nice big scarf while you were talking. So that was good. And... To be honest with you, I do find you very boring, and uh, I can imagine a lot of people would fall asleep listening to you. So keep up the good work. You know, even though that sounded like a compliment, it also didn't. <laughs> it's weird, isn't it? Yeah. Not really, not really interested, if I'm honest. No, no. Well, I think we should wrap this up. Oh, thank goodness. I thought this was going to go on forever. Honestly, if I thought you were going to talk so much that I'd run out of wool. I've already got through 14 sheeps already. Why is such an exaggerator? Yeah, I know. <laughs> anyway, I want to go. I'll see you later. Yeah, bye, mate. Um, right, so that's it. That's the end of this recording. Actually, wait. Okay, come back, come back, come back. Yeah, what? Do you want to do the ending? Yeah, all right, if you want. All right, then. You say it, then. Okay. Remember to be kind to yourself because you deserve to be happy. Lots of love. Bye. 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 Why have you... This is my recording. Let me say, I want to have the last word. Why? Well, I want to say goodbye. I'll let you do the last bit. Yeah, but that should be it. And then there's a gap. Did you not notice there was a little gap? And that should be the end of it. Yeah, but I want to say goodbye. I mean, people listen, they used to, they, they used to, to me listen talking and I, I always say goodbye at the end yeah and this time I say goodbye you said I could yeah it doesn't have to just play the game won't you what game 
What marbles? <laughs> marbles, marbles. Yeah, I don't mean marbles. I mean marbles. You know, where you chuck the balls on the floor and you you try and hit them with the other ball and. Yeah, but I don't think anyone's played marbles since nineteen eighty two. Well, I think you may be wrong there. Yeah, well, wouldn't be the first time. No. What do you mean? Oh, come on, let's not get into that anymore. I just want to go home. Yeah, I know, I know. All right, well, I'll speak to you later. And uh, goodbye, everyone. Yeah, goodbye, everyone. Uh, lots of love. Lots of love. Oi. Oi. Oh, come on, don't start repeating everything I say. <laughs> I do not sound like that. <laughs> right, I'm going. <laughs> okay. Bye, everyone.